Someone asked me just recently, you know, why would a man keep a woman around if he doesn't want her, if he doesn't love her? Why would he keep her? Why would he still keep her and be with her when he doesn't actually want her? Now, there are many different reasons. He's getting his food cooked. He's getting his needs met, whether it's sexual needs. He's getting shelter. Maybe he can't afford to leave. Bills. He has to invest right there because his kids are there. Yeah, many different reasons. Maybe he's waiting to find somebody, somebody who's better. Because he hasn't found it yet. So he's there just in case. Man, listen. People stay for the weirdest reasons. Maybe he's not ready for her. So he, is, he knows she ain't going nowhere. Because if she would have... If she wanted to leave, she would have been left already. She knows the vibration that she feels. She knows the connection is broken. She knows he's not there mentally, emotionally, psychologically. But he know, she knows he's there physically, and that's enough for her. And if he's not, she's there. He knows in his mind that she ain't going nowhere. So he's just, fulfill, he's just having fun. He's doing what he wants. He's doing what he likes. Until he's finished playing games or when his pee pee stop working. I don't know when he's going to stop. He stays with, the, with her and because he doesn't want her. Even, even though he doesn't want her because she has no boundaries. This is not victim blaming, by the way. I'm just telling you why. He has no discipline. He has no self-respect. Because... If he has self-respect, he wouldn't waste his time with someone he doesn't want. I mean, he really wouldn't. But in him not having self-respect, she doesn't have boundaries. She neither doesn't have self-respect. So as she waits for him to find her value, he finds less value in her. There's a lot of reason why a man will keep a woman around. All his needs are met. He don't have to go nowhere. He's getting everything that he desires from that place that he stays with. He knows it's a sure meal. It's a sure place to, to eat. It's a sure place to sleep. It's a sure place to have sex. When he leaves, he doesn't, he's not sure. He doesn't want to be there, but he's not sure if he can survive elsewhere. He doesn't know if he is better elsewhere. He doesn't know if he can be a decent man elsewhere. He doesn't know if somebody will accept the crap that he is given elsewhere. So he stays with her. Maybe he's not ready yet to be the man that she desires. And until then, he stays. Until he becomes that man. Or he chooses to become that man. Because he, he can become that man now, but he just don't want to. You see, those type of men have no discipline. And those men will waste their own time. So that means they will waste your time. They will completely put you on the side and waste both of your time because his time means nothing to him. That's the biggest thing. His time means nothing to him. His presence sucks because to put your presence around someone every day that you don't want to be, keep you around and don't want to be there, it's a lack of respect. And for her, it's a lack of self-respect. Listen, man, some dudes will do that just because they don't give a damn. They really don't. So you're going to see which one you fit. I don't know why the specific man is doing it or keeping her around. I, I can't tell you why. Because everybody is different. Everybody do it for different reasons. Sometimes they keep you around for the one time that they want you or the one time that they have a need for you. They keep you around just for that one day they might have a need for you. That one day that they might miss you. See, sometimes a lot of men keep you around because they know that you're a good woman. And they don't want to see nobody else with you. Because if somebody else could make you happy, they're going to hurt on the inside. Their ego is going to get crushed. So they keep you around because they can't afford to let you go. Because if they know that you're going to make somebody a beautiful wife, a great woman. So they hold on. They give you just enough to make you hold on to, them, to nothing. They give you just enough just to make you hold on to nothing. Just enough. The bare minimum. The bare words. Every time she's ready to leave, he knows, he feels 
and he does something to bring her back and she comes back because she don't really learn the lessons either. A lot of times, man, one of the biggest reasons is because that man know he's going to lose a good one who he's not ready for. Because he knows one day he's going to be ready for you and he wants you. So sometimes he do want you, but that's not right now. He found you early. And if he found you early before his time, he's going to hold on to you and keep you until he, that day he's ready. Because you are a good woman. You are good. You are good to him. You do all this stuff for him. He's just not ready for that goodness. See, everybody ain't ready for the pearls. And that's why the book said, don't cast your pearls, I mean, your pearls to the swine. Because they don't really know the quality of it. If she knows the quality of herself, she'll walk away. Because the more you wait for a man to change, is the more you begin to change. So why do men keep women around that they don't want? Because she chooses to stay. She has a choice too. He has reasons. His needs are met. You give him everything that he desires, but he gives you nothing. Why? Because you think that's all you can have. Think about it. Let me know your questions. Peace.